Now at 5.30, in another sign of America finally returning to normal, The Late Show with Stephen Colbert on CBS brought back its live audience last night. More than 400 fans packed the Ed Sullivan Theater for the first time in nearly 15 months. CBS 4's Meg Oliver was there. When a clearly elated Stephen Colbert walked onto the stage of the Ed Sullivan Theater after more than 400 days away, he was greeted by a nearly minute long standing ovation. I don't know if I even remember how to pander to the most beautiful crowd in the world. Hundreds waited in line for hours Monday after snagging tickets online. You ready for a laugh? I'm oh, ready yeah. for a real laugh. <laughs> I'm ready to see him in person. Chris Benz, where I can see him. Audience members had to show proof of full vaccination to attend the show. Guest John Stewart said we owe a debt of gratitude to science. Science has in many ways helped ease uh, the suffering of this pandemic. Uh, uh, which was m more than likely caused by science. You're shaking. I know, I'm so <laughs> excited. Marissa Godfrey, a nurse from Connecticut, says her family tuned into Colbert nightly during quarantine. He's been a form of therapy for, for me. Colbert got me through this pandemic. A lot of people thought this is going to be years before New York comes back to normal. Maybe it's actually just months. Brent Lang, Variety's executive editor of Film and Media, says the return of this staple is also a sign of hope. The majority of the city's theaters are set to reopen mid-September. Broadway brings in an estimated $14.7 billion to the economy and supports nearly 100,000 jobs. When you see this line, what does it symbolize? I mean, I think it symbolizes return and revival and restoration. It symbolizes the power and the strength of New York City. We are the first show back up on Broadway. Suck it, Lion King. The uplifting mood along this sidewalk last night was contagious. Everyone was smiling and strangers were making friends in line. They were so excited to be his first live audience back in more than a year. Meg Oliver, CBS News, New York. And, of course, you can watch The Late Show with Stephen Colbert tonight and every weeknight after the news at 11 right here on CBS4.